Hi, my name is Kaylin. On my first tutorial that I'm doing, I'm going to teach you how to draw and shade in a gem, which is right here. It's really cool. So you'll need a bunch of materials, of course. Actually, not really a bunch. So here are the materials. A pencil. I like paper made mechanical ones with extra lead. Then I use Prismacolor. So the ones that we'll need is the violet blue color for the outline. And then true blue and then true blue and the light cerulean blue for the inside, as you can see right there. And then you can you can use the Prism Color Blender pencil to straight everything in, but if you don't have that, you can just use like a light green pencil right here. So, right now, time to draw. So first, for the first part, you'll need to draw a big V. That. Make sure to make that light, or else like the pen also pencil lines will show through, and you don't want that. Then you just do a slight curved line to connect those. Show like to the dimensions of the gem. See, it's slightly curved. Then do finish knot top with another upside down V. You can make mistakes. You just erase them. And then, you know how the um, the gems, they always have like the line stuff, so I'm going to do those. I don't have them reaching exactly at the top, because it just looks cooler that way. Do it at the top too, make sure to make it three lines like that. Make sure to make them like, symmetrical. Time to color it in. So we'll do the violet blue. I'll do the violet blue again for the outlines. Make sure we make it nice and smooth lines. You can do this in hard. And if you want, you could just like make it white or something because you can always erase the pencil lines. Just color that in. the lines that I made. That's good. So for this you want to just go in the direction that this, oh, so I'm going to start with true blue first. So you just go in the direction that the line is facing. So you go like that. And again with this don't make it don't make it touch the line. Do it to all the sections. Make sure that it's nice and thick in there. Do it to the other side. done. Now it's time for the light cerulean blue. Just take it all the way to the edge. And make sure to go in the direction that the lines are going. Also it'll just look weird. And then I'm going to use the blender pencil to blend everything in. You can cross the lines that the line that's in the middle. That's okay. Now I'm just going to do the line in the middle again because it's been colored over a bunch. And there you have it. I'm just going to do my signature.
fun drawing lots of gems on your math homework. Just kidding. Thanks for watching. Bye.